Be quiet. Now be quiet. Well, you see, first of all, Mrs. Butters, this dog has got a cruel choke chain on, put on upside down. So I'm going to take it off because in all cases of nervous, hysterical, and dogs that, uh, that are really making a nuisance of themselves, we usually give them one good old jerk on a kind choke chain to show who is boss. So I'm taking this off. I'm putting my own on and making certain that it pulls upwards when she's on its left-hand side, as usual, in all training. And if the next time she makes a noise of any sort, but whether she does or she doesn't, I shall just give her a, a, a jerk, which shows, now you go to sleep. Put your head down and go to sleep. That's a good girl. You see, she's paying no attention whatsoever to the car. There are no barks, there are no whines. The dog is completely confident that whatever happens, the only thing that's happening is I'm getting covered in hairs. <laughs> Absolutely smothered. I got a new fur coat. Oh dear, you want the hoover on you. I've never seen her look so relaxed. <laughs> well, she's very happy, you see. I, uh, I've made her respect my, that she's safe with me by giving her, put your head down and go to sleep. Go if to sleep. the car stops for a second. I mean, yes, well, we we'll stop it for a second and yes. start. This is always what happens with this type of dog. Is they it? set off yes. as you set off. Yes. They start their noise. But you see, she's... Just stop her a moment. Here's a good girl. Here's a good girl. Now we set off again. Put your head down and go to sleep. She's had a jerk, which shows that any of this nonsense I'm not going to stand. And then we'll show, show you how when you're driving your car along, by the use of a long cord, she, the dog on the back seat, and the cord over your shoulder, preferably a passenger's shoulder to begin with, this dog should go to sleep until your journey's ended. Right, well, the first thing to remember, either when a dog's making a noise in a car, or when it's car sick, is that if it's lying down, it very seldom does either of these things, especially if its head is on the lap of somebody at the back. But of course, this is not always possible. Now, I have got a, a rope attached to her choke chain. You will give her a jerk on the choke chain to show that she, this is business. You, yes. She's going to respect what you say. This uh, is actually anchored on a, a clamp down here and over the passenger shoulder. And I hope you'll have a passenger for the first few drives before you take her out alone. Now, I'm going to give the command down. And I want you to push her paws that way so that if the car stopped suddenly, she wouldn't fall off. Uh, Tig, down. That's good. And the control rope would be over my shoulder, so that yes. if Tig got up, I would first of all give her a down command, and then I would tighten it, you see, so that she was kept down. Yes. You see, her head's yes, going now down. Yes. Down. Mm -hmm. There. She will then go to sleep. And she'll be perfectly comfortable. Mm -hmm. Now, inch by inch, I free it, so that for the rest of the journey, she is relaxed and happy. Now, if she attempted to get up, a thunderous command down, and don't look at her as you do it. We don't want her to know where it comes from. Just tighten the rope. That pulls her into the down. And then eventually, I don't think you'll need anything. You can just have the rope down here. If she does get up, even if you're by yourself, yes. you can give her a little bit of a pull. And if she's really a nuisance, then will you stop the car and get no, her down? I won't stop the car. I'll just tighten the rope. She must go down. You can stop the car if you're by yes, yourself, of yes, course, and do it. Yes. You can't do it when you're traveling. No. But remember to give her a bit of a jerk, because yes. there's nothing so soothing. Now, I've just jerked her. What's happened to her head? It's gone right down. Caught right down to sleep. Yes. It's yes. amazingly soothing, yes. uh, a, a jerk. It, it means confidence in the owner. <laughs> Mrs. Butters, it's two months since I yes. saw you and suggested a cure for your dogs barking in the car. What is it like now? Oh, much better, thank you very much. I mean, most of the time she's perfectly all right. She doesn't always sit down, but I don't mind that. She starts off sitting down. And um, if she gets a bit restless and starts to whine or pant, then I give her one of these chews, which just seems to relax her. Mm. And uh, on the whole, she's perfectly all right. You give her an occasional jerk if she does? Yes, I down. have the rope loosely over my shoulder, and I yes. give her an occasional jerk. Yes. And that does seem to help. Yes. I haven't gone on a very long journey yet, but I think I possibly could, though probably not on the motorway. <laughs> Thank you. 
The owner of this Dachshund wrote to say that it was very nervous with strangers and screamed terribly if anyone it didn't know tried to touch it. Well, what's wrong with this one? It doesn't like strangers, does it? No. Poor little doggy. Poor little doggy. Poor little doggy. Come on, dog. Come on, dog. Come. Come on. Come on, dog. Sit. Good dog. Good dog. Come, good boy. <coughs> no, now we'll have to put a choke chain on. You see, because you're going to lose your collar in a minute. Oh, poor little soul. Poor little soul. Yes, what a shame. What a shame. No, no, that's not it. That's not it, isn't it? Hey? That's not it. There's a girl. There's a girl. There's a girl. There's a girl. Very good. Very good. Very good. Mm. You said it didn't bite, didn't you? Never have. That's been very been naughty. Well, people had. haven't touched it, obviously. Put a choke chain on, we're going to stop yeah. this biting in the beginning. No dog must bite when it's touched, must it? No. I don't want that. Have we got your lead, please? I can't. Uh, there's a good dog. No, well, I mean, it's, it's naughty, isn't it? Would you put this on? No, oh, I can put it on. Now, we take this string off. Now, you see, if it's going to bite, it's got to be stopped biting. Yeah. But, I mean, um, a, a dog that bites is very different. You said it screamed. It doesn't... She does. Well, she isn't, is she? She's not screaming. She's just being... doesn't want to be touched. Mm. Oh, come on, my love. Now, stop it. <coughs> Clever girl. Clever girl. Clever girl. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. See, they've got to be mastered. Mm. Can't have them, uh, can't have them bite, can we? Come along, come along, come along, come along. <coughs> now, I tell you what I'm going to do with this dog. Um, where are our muzzles? You see, you, you, it's no good uh, trying to cure this dog unless it can be firmly and comfortably and quietly handled. Yeah. And this dog is not being handled, it's winning, because nobody's yeah. going to get bitten. Do you see? But it's not what, what I thought it was. I thought it was so frightened it would run away. Well, well if she was off the lead, she would, you say. Well, I mean, she isn't running away at all, is she? Come on, love. Come along. What's her name? Rosie. Come on, Rosie. Good girl. Good girl. Very clever. Very clever. Very clever. Come, Rosie, come. Good girl. Rosie, come. Clever girl. Poor little soul. Come on. Come on, Rosie. Come. Come on. Come on. Come. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Very clever. Very clever. Don't think I shall need a muscle. Very clever. Good girl. Very Rosie, come for a walk. Come on, Rosie. Walkies. Come on. Good girl. Come on, Rosie. Come on. Sit. Sit. Clever girl. Clever girl. Clever girl. Clever girl. No, I don't want it. Oh, she lovely. Oh, she lovely. Oh, she lovely. You see, people, if you snarl at them like that, it frightens you. We don't want our fingers bitten off, you know, even however beautiful your teeth are. Do we? No. You could go. You see, the thing is, you've got to, get, it got to be protected. You can't uh, train a dog and it's, uh, if, if you're not protected against being bitten. Mm -hmm. And you see, I gave her one good old jerk on the choke chain, which uh, frightened her, of course. She wasn't hurt, but she... She gave a yell because she, she'd never been retaliated. Nobody had been able to pick her up, had they? Yeah, no. Do you see? So, I mean, she thought she was boss. We don't have little Dexie's boss. Oh, no. Now, if I wanted her picked up by other people, I should muzzle her. Oh, 
Come on, love. Good Come girl. On. Now put the straight up. Pick up. Oh. No. Now wait a moment. Let's stop this. Let's stop this screaming. No, well she can't do something. Never it's nothing to do with unkind, it's nerves, that's yeah. all. Yeah. A poor little dog. I'll just clip the choke chain back so it doesn't act as a choke chain. There you are, love. There you are. Clever girl. Clever girl. Mm -hmm. Now, Joan, just come in again. I want you there to hold the lead fairly tight so her head gets up so she don't, can't roll oh, yes, sure. back. I've clipped it back okay. now. So yes. come in. Yes. And hold the lead in that hand fairly tight. Now, hand straight under her tummy and pick her up. <sighs> now, wasn't that better? That's better. Yeah. Now, yeah. maybe have a man uh, do it. Uh, Peter, would you like to do it? Put her down. Good. Now, just the same, Peter, if you would. Hold the lead fairly tight so her head is up so she can't in that hand. Yes. Then this hand goes straight underneath and picks her up. Now, what about that? No. <laughs> Let's get the change. <laughs> you see, clever girl. Girl. Let's take the muzzle off. I don't think she'll bite, Joan. No. If no. Be sure to keep her, um, her head up, do you see? Yes. There's a girl. There's a girl. There's a girl. Right, will you? Do you want me to keep yes. her? Just, 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 just do exactly what I did. Yes. Yes. Just, I don't think she'll do anything. Just yes. hold this down. Go slowly. Yes. Yes. Hold that fairly short. Yes. The, yes. This in this hand, fairly short. Do you see? Yes. Now, hand yes. straight under Tubby. Come on, Rosie. Good girl. There. There. You see, clever girl. Clever girl. Clever girl. You wouldn't feel like doing it in the spoon. No. <laughs> <laughs> well, fine. Anyway, there's two of us have done it. Exhibitors of show dogs have many different problems which may not seem important to the general public, but to them they are very real. Whenever I go to visit a show, I'm begged by the owners to help them with dogs who won't behave properly in the show ring. At the Bath Championship show, I was very kindly given a special ring to myself, and there was no shortage of problem dogs to help. Now, what's your problem? She cringes on the table and backs away from the judge. I see. And when she's moving, yes. she clamps her tail down. Oh, well, she needs a few jerks. Also, yes. Run her up and down, let's see what's wrong. Go on, run. Yes, I see. Give her a little jerk with the left hand so that she, she gets happier. That's right. Now lift her up on the table. Let me see what's wrong. You won't get her tail up in a second. Just lift her up. Oh, she wants to go up. Yes. Oh, that's right. Now, she's sinking away. No, don't yes. touch her. Come round by me. Yes. Don't, don't touch her for a moment. Let her, get, let her find her own feet, you see. She's got to get brave on her own. We can't make her brave. Here's a girl. That's better. Up with that old tail. Now, Joan, will you come and talk to her? Now, I give the command, go and talk on her hand, so when you're training, make her do this. Now talk. And <laughs> well, I can't see anything wrong with that, can you? Not at the moment, no. Well, now you've got to do it. <laughs> I want you to be brave. You've been what I call fumbling. You've been uh, uh, too close to the dog. You've, you've made her feel nervous. Do you see? When yeah. she's not. Now, we'll have her run round, and we'll stand her running round correctly, and then you'll lift her on the table. I yes. think that's beautiful. Don't you? Would you do it? A nice little circle, lift her on. Clever girl. <laughs> Clever girl. Go on, lift her down. 
run her around and make her stand quite still. That's better. Oh, I see the tail at half mast. Do you? Yes. Drop your right hand, keep your left hand in front and look at the judge, not the dog. Right, now say wait. Wait. Yes, now stand her. Very quickly, very quickly. You're too slow. Right, stand her and put her tail up under your hand. Now, what's wrong with that? Super. Now lift her up on the table and do the same thing. You're a bit slow in, in going into her. You want to go in and do it immediately and get away from her. She's got to stand on her own two feet. Four feet, sorry. No, you're in stand. front of me or you're wrong. Don't get in front of her. Yeah. Stand, stand her here. Stand her up. And get right away. Now, put her on the table like that. Get right away. Now, as I come in, uh, yes, but your thumb mustn't be over her nose. Turn, turn your hand like, yes, that's right. Now say talk. Talk. Girl, a girl, what a clever girl. That's what better. a clever girl. Right, you can drop her now. Now, I consider that this dog is looking extremely nice. Yes, I don't like your hand, your thumb over her no, nose. I'm afraid we all you do that. No, you mustn't. No. Get your hand out this way and your hand under the clever girl. Do you see? Just, just like that. If she stoops, just tickle the inside with one finger only, the inside of the thigh. Do you see how she's come up now? Yes. Do you see? Yes. Well, now go in and win. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Well, now, what's wrong with this one? Uh, he won't move very well in the ring. I have to hold him on a tight... String him up, in fact. Yes, yes right that's very tight. bad. And yes. when I'm placing him, he's, he tends to move around. Won't well, yes. fidgets with his back yes, legs. Yes, yes. And yes. he's then fidgety all the time. All the time. He's he never around. examines, never stands for no. examinations, as no. they say, in the yes. professional yes. circles. And his name is? Reuben. <laughs> Reuben, are you going to do a big good boy? <laughs> Make certain of it. <laughs> 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 Come. Wait. Wait. <laughs> Anything wrong with that? Perfect. Well, now, you see, it's just one jerk that does it. We understand each other, don't we? <laughs> one big jerk, and you know it's now's the time to look beautiful. Now, did you see how hard I jerked him? That frees the choke chain immediately. You must not close the choke chain on the neck. It's not kind. Now, down. Down. you want to get him over two fingers of the right hand like that. Loose in front of him so he follows it, follows your hand. This hand out of the way, except a jerk, and the jerk must be jerk and let go. There must Did you all hear the click I gave him? I heard a few ghastly gasps. <laughs> but actually it doesn't hurt at all, you see. And unless you hear the click, it means the choke train is not freed. Therefore, it's not kind because it's closed on the neck. Now, you mustn't put your hand down there. Naughty. Come here. <laughs> That's what happens. <laughs> right. Now, will you put your... Over there. And that hand there. Now you say, get him, get his, your hand ahead of him, and look, don't look at him, look at those children over there. Are you ready? Action. Right. Say, walkies. walkies. Oh, wait, turn you Now, go on, run. Don't look walkies. at him. Drop your hand, drop your hand. Oh, no. <laughs> no. You see, the thing is that your hand, you've been stringing him up, and therefore he's used to being choked. Come on, love, walkies. Come on. Come. Wait. Wait. Stand. Good. Stand. <coughs> you see? Well, now you must do that. This hand must not rise up or he jumps up. Your hand must be ahead of him. Will you try it? Now don't look at him. 
Get your left hand right out of the way. Left hand here. Here, look. That's right. He keeps coming around to my front. Of course yeah. he would, because oh. your hand is oh. up here. Right. Drop your hand. Right. Go on now. Ruben? Don't talk to him. Get rid of your left hand in front of you. Well, that's beginning. Go on. Don't look at him. You're looking at him. Don't look at him. Look at me. Look at me. Look at me. Ruben, drop your hand. Come on round. Look, he's gone. Move, dear. Get rid of your left hand. Good. Well done. Come on back. Now say wait. Wait. Now please quickly. Don't waste time. Now, Joan, come in and talk. My God, you'll be catch it if you don't give him first. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's marvellous. If you all, you. all my pupils were as good as you, I <laughs> shouldn't you. be here. <laughs> Thank you. I thought that's that was fabulous. Point. You are a fabulous dog. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to tickle her chest. Would you like to get away from her, right away from her? That's right. Oh, no. This dear little dog is a Chinese crested, and its problem was nerves. It didn't like being handled by the judge and wouldn't stand up properly on the table. Good. Good. I'll just take her for a little walk first and let her come with me. She's got to have a few jerks on the choke chain to make her brave. Come on, what's her name? Cleo. Come on, Cleo, walkies. Walkies, come on, Cleo. Right, wait. Will you come in and just handle it? Now I give the command, go and talk, and a loose lead, and place my scent on, on Joan Cudd's hand. She is an international judge of Dalmatians. Go and talk. Now, oh no, would you like to take her for a walk and bring her up on the table and I'll approach her? That's right. Now, firmly up. I'll come into her first. Now, you're placing her. That's very, looks very nice. Now, look, you must get this through of your hand. Go, look, look at me. Back to your chest. Go and talk. Go on. Talk. No, you're stringing her up. You see, the moment you string them up, you, you, lo you lose confidence and they sit back. You see, let her stand on her own. Now, Joan, come in and talk. That's right. Good girl. Do you see? Isn't that better? You see, this is what I want you to do. Get away from your dog. You're, you're uh, passing nerves, thinking she's going to do it. All right? Clever girl. There you are. Well... She's freezing cold, but uh, I think go in and see what you can do with her in the ring right, now. Thank you very much. Right. Oh. That's oh. my best breed. Oh. Good gracious. Reserve best bitch. She yes. three first. Three first yes. and reserve best bitch. Oh, isn't that lovely? Now you can carry on become a champion with her, <laughs> can't right, thank you? Sure. Clever girl! I'm thrilled to death for you, oh, just as you. thrilled as if it was my own. That's right, thank you very much. Well done. <laughs>